Ray Rush the Savage. You wanna say good morning, girl? Savage, come on, mama. Shout out Ray Rush the Savage. How y'all doing there, man? It's Ray Rush the Savage. Listen, bro, listen. So, I don't know. I, keep, I like to keep up with the 2K community. I, I'm a big fan of them. So, I might do my album, you know, go back into it, you know. And I've been, I don't know if y'all been keeping up with these, these top 10 lists, but they've been going kind of crazy. Now, uh, Larry Bird came on here, or uh, AJ LaPre. He came on here and he said the truth, my real top 10 basketball YouTuber list. He, I guess he was offended that he said he looked like Larry Bird. I mean, I'm not gonna lie, bro. You do look like Larry Bird, no cap. But now, we, I wanna go ahead and see what he got to say. I wonder what his top 10 is. Cause he ain't like the top 10 list that everybody was reacting to. So, let's go ahead and get into it asking for it so i had to do it today we're making the top 10 list of the best basketball youtubers and let me just say it's a lot more difficult to make this top 10 so what qualifies him to make the top 10 that's what i want to know i know uh i remember watching reacting to the other video he said if him and team on nine number one he is not accurate but i want to know what qualifies him to say that you know let's, let's go, let's go. You're lagging, boy. You're lagging. Than I actually thought it would be. There's a lot of really good basketball players that have started YouTube channels, and then YouTubers that also play basketball. There's just a plethora of categories here of you know pro players, street ball players, hooper hoopers. But what I'm gonna do with all these categories? Man. Different types of top 10 list, this and that. I'm gonna squash all the categories ass, and I'm bro. gonna add everyone into one top 10 list right here. And the only people I'm gonna exclude are NBA players, you know, like the Kevin Durant, Jimmy Butlers, those guys that have YouTube. Boy, your video ass. Your video booty cheese. And list right you know here. That. And the only people I'm going to exclude are NBA players. You know, like the Kevin Durant, Jimmy Butler, those guys that have YouTube channels. And I have love for all of these guys on this list. But I think I've compiled the best top 10 list, the most accurate top 10 list out there. And before we get started with the list, I want you guys to know I'll be reacting to other people's lists. But on my second channel, I'll link that in the description below. You guys can go subscribe to that and check out my reactions. This is a fun time in YouTube where we get to debate and talk about who's the best, who should be the top 10. So I think it's pretty exciting. Now let's get into the list. At number 10, this may be shocking and surprising to a lot of people, but at number 10, I've got my man, Jesser the Laser, the one and only Jesse. And I put Jesse at number 10 on this list because he is extremely skilled, guys. This guy's got a legit lethal arsenal of moves in his bag, and he's played a lot of one-on-one -on -one games against some very high-tier talents, NBA guys, um, college-level guys, all sorts of people like that. And Jesse, I seriously think if Jesse would have committed as much time to playing basketball as he did growing his YouTube channel, I think Jesse could for sure have played at the college basketball level. But at such a young age, he went straight into YouTube and, and he has absolutely flourished in YouTube. So Jesser comes in at number 10 on this list and at number 9 I had to throw someone in that has been super slept on throughout all of these lists. He's played professional basketball in China. My boy, Nelly Nel Chan. His channel is Hoop in Life and him and I actually played a one-on-one -on -one way back last year about Come on, bro. Who is this? Actually, and it was a tough the fuck is that? one. He's a smaller guard that is oh. quick and has crazy bounce. I see him. He's like 5'9 and he can windmill dunk. Insane. I see him. I see him, bro. He's a shooter also and my man plays 
pro basketball. You know, that's actually on my shit this morning. For some I reason. Sleeping on him on these lists. So uh, I had to put respect. I don't know why his name was on the list. Like, and I had a really difficult time ordering the seventh spot, eighth spot, and ninth right, spot on this right. list. All of them I feel like could be pretty interchangeable by their skill level and size, really. So hmm. next up in the eighth spot, I have my man. Jay Jones. I've only played with him once, but he's an absolute scorer. He's got it all, guys. He, he's he's quick, explosive, got a jumper, can get to the cup, plays good defense. So big time respect to Jay. He definitely earned my respect when I played with hey. him. Hey. Oh, this shit. Oh, it hey, pop. Um. I was trying to figure out what qualifies him. Like, I might be tripping. I might be tripping. But, uh. Uh, bro, like, you're like you just um, I don't know, bro. It just look like he, he's just trying to take Cash Nasty out. Like it, that's what it look like to me. Like it's just like he don't fuck with Cash. You know what I'm saying? Fly, even though Fly don't deserve to be on the top ten list. Like, I don't know, bro. It's like he's just trying to cut everybody out. Um, so I'm not, am I hitting this? Shit? Look. Something not right, bro. I think, dude. I don't know. Like you hating a little bit, low key. But I might be tripping. I might be tripping. Out in LA, so he takes in the eighth spot right here. But at the seventh <laughs> spot, we got my man Tristan Jess, who is an absolute phenom. He's got like the quickest hands. With oh yeah, he hating. This dude right here, a AJ LePray hating. There ain't no way, like, T Jazz is like, like, you know, like, he's, so for some reason, every time I see him, he reminds me of an orange or some shit, like, this, a meme or some shit. This nigga, like, this nigga is nice. He's smooth with the basketball. Like, so at this point, having this nigga at number seven, this nigga trolling like a motherfucker. Gotta be, ain't no way. Basketball I've seen in a long time. I got, I got to see who next. Like, man. I'm actually professor like live reacting. So. So, but T Jazz is I like know. a young professor on the way up. I feel like the only thing that separates the professor and T Jazz on a, a major level is that the professor's played professionally and T Jazz has only played at the high school level. Even if he played it at the college level, I'd probably bump him up on the list <laughs> even more. But he's an extremely talented dude. When I saw him play in person for the first time, I was like, oh my god, he's he's legit. His hands and all the layup, crazy layups he do, does are insane in person. He has crazy ball speed, so much respect to T Jazz for man. sure. Next, coming in at the six spot, I got. Guy. I gotta see what number six is. If T Jazz in at number seven, right? If T Jazz, oh, oh man, if T Jazz at number seven, I gotta see who number six. There ain't no way T Jazz is at number seven. It don't make any sense, like. Uh, got zero respect on these top ten. I fought with a Kobe shirt though. I'm a big Kobe fan. Unless who definitely deserves it. He's played college ball. He's an absolute unit. He's lethal with his left hand in around the basket. He's got a great jumper. My man, Marcellus Howard, comes in at number six easily. Him and I have hooped together a few times now. And he is extremely talented. Mm -hmm. When I watched him, I was like, oh, he's got it. He's got it. You know, it's just one of those players like, oh, he's, he's got it. He's legit. Count him okay. in our top 10 list. Easy. So, big shout out to All Marcellus. Right. That left hand is lethal. I wish I was left. All right, bro. <laughs> Charlie was acting a fool, so he'll help me make the, the top 10 list also. So, Marcellus comes in at number six. He actually just dropped his, his college highlights, so you guys should go check those out for sure. And, you know. On some real shit. You know what I'm saying? I ain't seen a nigga up here that can fuck with so Illuminati. And that's just real. Like, I ain't seen one nigga on this shit yet that can fuck with Soul Illuminati. And if Soul Illuminati not on this list, your list is bullshit. You know what I'm saying? Like, your list is bullshit if Soul Illuminati on this. That's what I'm saying. Just, that's just real. Like, I can't, I can't fuck with you. AJ LaPray, Larry Bird. I can't. Larry, I can't fuck with you, Larry. And that's because. It's not that I'm I'm trolling. I'm not doing none of that shit. I'm just trying to see like where your head is. And if so, I'm not on. I can't focus. You know what I'm saying? You already tried to take. It look like you're trying to take everybody out. You know what I'm saying? Oh, huh. 
It doesn't seem like you don't fuck with some people. There's not many people on this list who have college highlights, really. So, big shout out. So, are you basically if they played college ball before or some shit? Like, I don't know, dude. I can't really fuck with you like that. I can't. That's because he can really hoop, and he brings us in at the number six spot. And at number five, I've got to get this guy on the list also. He hasn't been on any list. He's got over a million subscribers on YouTube, so I don't understand how people aren't putting him in on this list. My man, B-Dot, A-Dot. He went out and played professional basketball. How are we excluding him on, on these lists? We got we to gotta make these lists real, man. This is the real basketball YouTuber list right here, guys. This is, I'm not leaving anyone off. You fucking... Bitch, hold on. Except for NBA players. B Dot's tough, he loves that fadeaway in the corner, and if he's hot, he, he can make that eight straight times. So I, I gotta give B Dot at number five on this list. Next up, Yo, man. B Dot, A Dot, that's a nigga now that was making them skits, ain't it? Hold on, hold on. This list is a person that none of us wanna guard, okay? Charlie doesn't even wanna guard this guy. I know you don't want to guard him. I don't want to guard him. It's not fun, okay? So at number four, I've got my bro, the bone collector, okay? The one in that right. you guys are seeing. He snatches ankles. That nigga is good. It's, it's scary defending that guy. So I'm, I'm going to keep it real. His hezzy move has you on your heels. Like, you're so confused at how fast this guy is with his hesitation move. So... That's why Bone Collector comes in at number four. I put I would have put him higher, but he's a little undersized, so you can kind of contain him on that. But he has worked on his jump shot, and his shot has gotten a ton better. So yeah, I gotta see what he got on this list for sure. Big shout out to my boy Bone Collector. I got you. I got you. He's played all of these the street ball tours and everything, so he's legit. Because so far, so like, okay, like, all right, guys, we got the okay, top but three. He already two got cash. The final oh, three he spots not for the top like, ten best. Basketball YouTubers. Here we go. Coming in at number three. All right, Charlie, thanks for your help. I'm going to put you down because I know you want to go play with your tennis ball. We've made it to the final three. And coming in at the three spot, this may surprise a lot of you guys. But I think you'll understand when you hear who one and two are. So coming in at the three spot, I've got the one and only. The Giraffe Gang leader, uh, my guy, LSK, a.k.a. Chris London. He's extremely talented. He's got... Alright, now. LSK is number three. Now I had to see who number one and two is. You know what I'm saying? Like, I have to. And... I have a feeling it's going to be him and Timo, right? I Because in the other thing, he said, um, if me and Timo not one and two, then the list is, you know what I'm saying? So I think this nigga bullshit, and, and I'm calling it bullshit, and that's just, that's just real. That's just me. This nigga is, bull, this nigga is on some bullshit. Hold on. Crazy long arms and bounce, too. I mean, he's, what, 6'9", 6'10". I've only hooped with him a couple times now, and I, I can tell he's he can actually play, man. This guy this guy is legit. He's a real hooper. So he went out and he played college basketball as well. He's got the experience. He knows he's what's up. Fuck he knows where he ball. Yeah, yeah, um, wants to be on this list. He wants to be number one, I'm sure. Just like all the other guys on this all list. All right, all right. Uh, yeah, let's go. Come on, now. And I love it. That competitive nature, man. We're going to get something going. With all these guys, we're going to make it happen. I put Chris at number three, and I think you guys will understand why once you hear who the number one it, and number two it, spot it, are. So we're going to move right it, into that. Bro, the number shit. two I just spot, know. I have the most It got to be him or Timo. Either him or Timo. List, and the best dunker in the world. My man, Chris Staples, comes in at all right, all right. two on my top ten list. Hands down, you guys have seen him do crazy things. Chris Staples. He dunks on anyone. But he isn't just a dunker, guys. He can shoot the ball as well. I've seen this guy okay. reel off. I thought it was I thought it was going to be him or Timo, man. My bad, my bad. It doesn't bad. even matter. Out in Venice Beach, when it is, it's hard to shoot on those courts, but he can get them up, and then he goes and dumps on people also. So that's why Chris comes in at number two. And uh -huh. finally, at the number yeah. one spot, okay. we have the GOAT of them all. 
the greatest of them all. The reason a lot of us are on YouTube right now is because of this guy, okay? He started it all. He made it happen. He, he came up. In my hometown, so okay. I gotta recognize. I gotta show love, show respect where, it, where it needs huh? to be. He came up and played in the And One tour. He's showed us all what's up in his Spider-Man series. Come on, I got time for this bullshit. Grayson Boucher, aka yo, yo. the Professor, is number one on the top ten list. Bro, fuck you, like yo, fuck you, bro. What the fuck? <laughs> In Bruh. circles, not knowing where they are or who oh, they're yeah. regarding it. Oh, yeah. This just proves me I can't take you serious. And I just, I'm done with this video. Like, you done took cash out. You done took down. Yeah, like, you know, I don't give a fuck. He, he don't like some he don't like some people and it's obvious to me that he doesn't like some people and he took him out and just took him out and not gonna lie bro I don't know who who is that number 10 Jesser Jesser nice bro okay I give that but Cat Nasty I think better than Jesser on his on his on his grind alone on his he said alone. I can't fuck with you. I don't I don't agree with anything you're saying. You're bullshitting me and you can kiss my ass. Alright, I'm gonna catch y'all in the next video. Seatbelts, everyone! Please let this be a normal field trip with a friend. No way! Oh. Cruising on that main street, you really like feeling good.